Predicting what the strengths of the Miami Dolphins defense might be it's no piece of cake. Just like last season, I'm again hesitant to offer up the strengths of the defense for this coming season. The reasoning behind this is still the same, I just found out that my prediction for last season which was quarterback pressures turned out to be third overall in the entire league. And the season before that the prediction was turnovers. As it turns out, that was first overall in the entire league. So you can see where the apprehension comes from. It's from wanting to keep a prediction record going, possibly in the top 5, I'd be really happy with that, not only would I be happy, but many fans of the Miami Dolphins would be as well. Because that would mean the defensive unit performed quite well. The unit hasn't changed that much personnel-wise, however, the departure of former Miami Dolphins head coach Brian Flores presents a question mark as to how much of a factor he played in setting up and keeping this unit on the track they are on now. Josh Boyer the defensive coordinator has stayed on board and has a little more weight on his shoulders to show that he played a factor as well, and can keep the unit on track, and also improve as well. Boyer also represents the Patriots connection that helped to set up the defense being multiple. So while the Patriots way may not seem to be represented it actually is instilled in the defense, so let's review the last few seasons. The season before last was turnovers, followed by pressures, which ranked first and third respectively. And I would fathom a guess the progression would be for points allowed to be next, for this to happen the defensive unit has to take the next step, they have been good, really good at times, even great. Greatness and consistency are what is next for this Miami Dolphins defensive unit.